this was the longest receipt that Poundland has ever printed. Look at it. It just goes on and on. £346 spent. So we're about to go into Poundland and spend a lot. <laughs> Foggy glasses. Getting these uh, metal baskets, they're always really good. Two gold and two silver. Gonna grab one of these for three pounds. And then one of these gorgeous bubble jugs for 150. And I'm also gonna get some of these mixer glasses. They're nice. Now I'm gonna grab one of these each. So they've got grey, black and white there, three pounds. These are the size extra large. We're already having trouble filling our baskets. We ask if they have tro trolleys and they don't. Round okay, ones too. no, the small ones now. Let's get one of each. Oh, and the medium. Let's get the medium. The medium. So they've got white, black, grey. We're going to get one of each of those. And then medium, they only had white. I did one, one of every colour in that as well. I just found the medium actually in grey and black. And they're twin packs, so you get two for the small ones in there. Struggling already. <laughs> We've got a lot more to spend. How much do you reckon all of this is so far? Um, I'm not bothering. <laughs> That's why we look at all the bags we've got. I'm going to get two of these. They're a pound each. Clothing covers, none woven, and it zips up 100 by 60 centimeters. Now I'm going to grab one of these. I love these frames. They're so handy. Oh, they've got some new things in. Look at this. Green bowls, 150. You've got all the stuff that matches. And then we've got a nice Mondo brown. They've also got these marble ones. And then the pink. They've got marble bowls as well that match with the mugs. And then you've got the plates. Some nice new mugs in. These are really nice. Shades of pink, you've got the shades of black, and then um, like green. We've also got these new in. Oh, that's really nice. Placemat and coaster set. And these are five stacking mugs. Gonna grab one of these hamper, hamper sets. If I can get it off. I'm also gonna get the brown one. Yeah, grab one of those. Um, a table cover as well. And then this and that. What, one of these? <laughs> nah, the plates. Oh my gosh. Got my uh, lovely assistant here. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. And this one. That's really good though for two pounds. This is oh, a party nice. section. Laughter. So, because I don't have trolleys and we've already filled up these little wheelie ones, we're going to have to cash up, tell them if they can hold it, then come back and carry on shopping and cash up again. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to probably have to make two trips to the car because there's so much to carry. This is too full. <laughs> so, let's head over to 
cash it all up and we'll see how much it comes up to. Um, and like I said, this, this isn't even all of it. We've still got a lot to do. A lot to buy, rather. Yeah. I'm starting to feel a bit embarrassed because we've got a queue and then oh, we're going to keep so many people up and then we've got to ask like some really weird oh, stuff. Yeah. <laughs> oh, awkward, awkward. So that was £46 so far, round two. <laughs> I'm going to grab one each of all of the Halloween items. Starting at the bottom. <laughs> yeah. So we're going to be here. I don't know. When do they close? 7 o'clock. We've got some time. But we're going to be here so long. Picking each of these Halloween bits and then checking out. I'm actually going to be really embarrassed checking out because we're going to be holding everyone up. Next bits now. It's already like almost full. Gunks, check. I thought these were penguins, but they're owls. Look at the baskets now. We've still got a lot to go. All that as well. We've got four trolleys full so far. The staff have actually said that they'll take some over already to do the um, checkout while we carry on. Okay, so we're on like trolley number six now, I think. Going towards another Halloween section here to fill another trolley. Oh, they've got some really nice new bits in the Christmas range. Look at these, they're candles. The big ones are three pounds. And they've got the cloches back in that light up. And the tea lights. They've got some new ornaments, some stag heads. Some bottles with the lights in there. These lanterns are really nice. They've even got lights in as well as baubles. They're five pounds. And then they've got some really nice string lights here. Wooden stars for four. Oh, they've got these out again. I know everyone really liked the hand gestures. They're two pounds. And then lots of gunks here. Look at them. They've even got these angels or fairies, whatever you like to refer to them as. The big gunks at the bottom are eight pounds. They've got these Christmas pots in for three and then some tinsel wreaths. Breakfast set, mug and bowl for five there. Trolley. Oh my God, I, I don't know how long we've been here. An hour and a half, I think. Oh, it's really embarrassing. They've been there beeping our stuff for the longest time. And we've got one left. Now we just need to wait. I'm still 49 so far. So all of this is ours. And we're not even done. We're still checking out. And we've got like so many bags at the back as well. How are we going to get this to the car? I don't know. So we spent 46 pounds. And then this receipt here is so long. They were literally joking about how long it is. Look at it. They took a photo and everything. £300. We actually have a staff helping us carry it all to the car. And I've got my hands full as well. That was a mission. Crazy, crazy. How nice of the staff, they were so good, they were really nice. I mean, like, he's going out of his way to help us take all of us to the car. We've got the bags here, we've got some in the back of the car as well. We just yeah. said bye to the staff. Yeah, yeah, I was telling everyone, yeah, nice. it was really nice of them. Nice. Right, finally, going home. So this is everything. Look at it, all the way there. And look at how huge that bag is as well. What do you think about these, Leo? I thought these were pretty good quality. Look at them. Fur spider. Do you like that? 
This is one of my favourites from the Halloween range this year. They've got two different ones. Here's the other. And I love that they light up. I love everything that lights up. Leo's not impressed. Another good one is this. I would say that the quality isn't that great on these. Like you can see here, it's already come apart and they scratch very easily. But I do like the designs on there and the candle inside as well. These are quite sweet. Did anyone pick one of these up this year? The little tea light holders. Spiders with long legs. Another favourite of mine are these. I love anything in little jars. But how cool is it? I love the little house inside. Another favourite are these. Um, I really like the whole pumpkin range. They've got the candles and then they had another colour. They've also got the cauldron candles which are really nice. They are sniff testing everything. <laughs> so I'm getting everything out the bags. That's everything so far but I've still got a ton to go. These were quite interesting this year. They brought them out a little bit later. I don't know about your stores but they've got a few different ones to choose from. And what else was my favourite? Oh, I liked these. I do wish that they were a little bit better quality, but I do love the arrangement in there. And the pumpkins. He was making himself comfortable. Oh, and these. That's why I brought so many. They are so useful, especially for organisation. Like the bathroom, especially under the sink. That kind of thing in the kitchen as well and these are pretty cute i do love all of their tea light holders i just hope this doesn't crack when an actual candle is inside if you have had that experience please do let me know here's some more of my favorites the cauldron candle and the tea light holder i love cats and so this is definitely one of my favorites um, yeah, I've showed you guys that already. I always love these glitter pumpkins. You get 20 in a pack, small miniature ones. Here's another one of those Halloween nutcrackers. I do love the cat masks as well. I should actually wear that and see what my cats react like with it on. That'd be really fun. I had to sit down for a break because <laughs> this has just been a lot more than I actually thought. I don't know why. I know it was 360 or something pounds, but yeah, I've still got that huge bag to get through. And you can see I'm just piling it up everywhere. I've even got like a tumbler in there, a bowl in there. I'm just running out of space. I feel like I've got the whole shop in here. If you're enjoying the video so far, leave me a thumbs up and make sure you're subscribed for more content. And before you ask, this is going to be shipped to loads of friends. It's a Halloween special video. And this is everything I brought.